Hey everybody, it's Lebo with Lebo's Pinball, and today I've got uh, what could be a pretty short video, uh, but it's just a quick um, demonstration of how to put blades on, at least how I do it. Um, I've done a bunch of these. Uh, I mean, golly, probably, I don't know, maybe around 10 or so, maybe eight or 10. Um, and Every time that I've done it, I've actually removed the play field. I know that there's other instructions out there where you can, uh, you know, have, with the play field still in it, um, you know, kind of work around it. I just have never even tried doing it that way because that just always seemed like that was really, um, uh, it looked like it was going to be really difficult and asking for trouble. And yeah, I know the trade-off is, you know, pulling the play field out is, uh, it's not the easiest thing, but I'm doing it anyways in a lot of the repair work that I'm doing. And the other big risk is when you put the play field back in, you want to be really careful not to scrape uh, the plates. But I've got something for that too uh, to try to help protect it. But let's go ahead and kind of get started. So the first thing I did, obviously I've taken the play field out. It's still hooked up. I've got the power unplugged from the machine. So there's, there's actually really nothing at all hot here. Um, but I've still got all the cables hooked up. I've just got the, the play field leaning over to the side. I've I took a, a paper towel and a bunch of rubbing alcohol and I just kind of cleaned this up. It's all dry. Uh, and I also, also took the, um, there's a nut here. It's this, this barrel nut. Uh, I've removed that um, out. This is part of the, the hinge for the back box. So that, that back, back box is basically just sitting on there. The bolts are still going through. It's really not going to go anywhere. Uh, so, could do a couple things. Um, I could, you know, of course, line this hole up here with that bolt hole and, you know, hold this down here and looking along this top edge, you don't want it to come above where the channel is. The, the glass is, is going to be sliding in there. So, I just like to come up there close, you know, really close to it, but just leave just a tiny little bit of clearance. Um, and I was going to say, a couple things I could do is I could put some tape here. Uh, clamp something to sort of hold it in place and I have gotten the past couple times I've done these I, I just kind of gotten bold to where I went ahead and just started to go ahead and pull off the backing and by the way this these blades this is for hurricane and I was not able to find any place in the United States that sold these uh, for hurricane I think there was maybe I could have gone with you know con was it um, Cyclone or so, or maybe another game had something that probably would have been a good alternative idea and had I thought of that earlier That's probably what I ordered. But what I ended up doing is from um, Retro refurbs. I think they're in England or somewhere over in, in Europe. I ordered them from the ordered from there and they've shown up just showed up today. In fact um, And it took a while they did a great job getting them out fast um, It's just the shipping the reality is it takes I think it was like maybe five weeks or so for it to show up, uh, going through customs and all. But here we go. I'm very committed to this already. So the thing is, when you put it, put this on, you can very carefully kind of position it on there. And if it sticks, you can carefully lift it up. What I'm gonna try to do is I'm aiming for that hole. That there, I'm trying to line up the edge, keeping some tension on this little time. There, pretty happy with that. So now, just smoothing it out. Here we've got a little, yeah, just, yeah, no interferences. I was thinking I was going to have to get around that back channel there, but no, it's, it's right on there, just fine. I don't see any wrinkles or bubbles. I'm just trying to press it on nice and tight. If I had a roller, 
I'd probably go back and forth on this, but I will just keep rubbing it down nice and tight. But that's basically it for this side. I'm going to go to the other side. Uh, the only difficulty there is I've got this, uh, the, the cable that, that's here in the way. Um, but we'll go ahead and switch over to that side and see how it goes. All right, so we're switching over to the other side. Let me get this, the backing peeled off. Get things ready to go. This decal actually had a little bit of, tiny little bit of damage down at the bottom corner, but I am not concerned about that at all. Because a couple of reasons, once I press this down on there, it's really gonna pull that, should pull that wrinkle pretty much out. And even bigger reason than that, it's down below the play field. It's gonna be an area that no one would ever see. There's a little bit of wrinkle up at the top. That one's maybe a little less, or that one might be a little more visible. Okay, so I should have pulled this out of the way. Actually, what I will do, grab a clamp. Okay, so we'll take this. something to kind of hold the cable up out of the way. Of course, unless you've got a helper, then it will help a lot. All right, let's get this, this lined up. Lift it up just a little. All right, and now it's on. And no wrinkles at all. It's holes lined right up. It's good to go. All you need to do is throw these barrel nuts back in just here and tighten it up it's done let's go this side whoops push the bolt down grab the bolt real quick That's nice and tight. All right. All right, so here's the other little trick that I like to put on here is these little protectors. Just lay them on. I forgot where I got these. Uh, I will... Uh, it says Pinball Universe on the side. I don't even know where who, I don't recognize that name. Anyways, um, uh, fine, I might put it in the description. But anyways, so with that in place, now I get to go lift up the play field and put this back in and hopefully not screw anything up. So there's always the fun part. Let's get this a little better position.
that's in. Put these out. There. They are in position. And play fields down. Ready to go. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Step right this way.